coming to you from our GIS studios. I am Anisia Antoine, and this is your midday news brief. The Shivnin Scholarship winner for St. Lucia was officially announced on Friday, August 21st, in a news release from the British High Commission in Castries. Karen Nelson copped the award for St. Lucia, joining eight other awardees across the region from Antigua and Barbuda, Barbados, Dominica, Grenada, and St. Vincent and the Grenadines. She will be pursuing an MSc in Media Communications and Development at London School of Economics and Political Science. Applications for 2021 to 2022 Chivnin Scholarships will officially open on September 3rd and close on November 3rd, 2020. Interested persons will be able to apply at www.shivnin.org slash apply. Considering the dire consequences of the pandemic on household incomes after consultations with various district youth and sports councils, the National Youth Council, NYC, decided upon a fundraiser. The NYC played its part by organizing a virtual telethon to provide educational assistance for at-risk students. This drive, dubbed Pledge for a Child, aired on the National Television Network from the GIS Studios on Sunday, August 23, 2020. The NYC raised in excess of $35,000 towards the cause. Since the transitioning of Victoria Hospital to the Owen King EU Hospital on March 27, 2020, work has been ongoing in transforming the facility into a respiratory medical center. Converting VH has come at a significant cost that was unforeseen, much like the novel coronavirus. Nevertheless, Health Minister Senator Honorable Mary Isaac says government is committed to completing the respiratory hospital as it plays a major role in the island's efforts at combating COVID-19. With the onset of COVID-19, plans by the Ministry of Health to utilize the Victoria Hospital as a polyclinic following the opening of the Owen King EU Hospital have been paused. Minister Isaac estimates that the respiratory hospital will be fully functional by the end of September. Five respiratory clinics have also been set up at the Grizzly Polyclinic, Lackley Wellness Centers, Denry Hospital, Beaufort Wellness Center, and the Soufre Hospital. This has been your midday news brief. Thank you for watching.